it's literally still the same day that I changed the 80 millimeters orangutan wheel, the regular stock V, uh, V2, I guess you can say, coming from this, pretty much this wheels right here, these same exact wheels are the ones that I have on my Booster Boy Mini X right now. But today in the, in the mail, I changed it this morning and now I'm gonna change it right, right back again. We're gonna change it to the 100 millimeters BOA, Think that's how they they're called or whatever the case may be the comparison Jesus. to the stock ones it's crazy we're also going to be changing the bearings these bearings i got from online i'll be putting the link up somewhere here in the video um and yeah they're supposed to be they're supposed to be better uh we'll, we'll see what what type of performance we get today so let's get to it New ones, but I'm saying they use, they use the same size, right? Huh? The bearings. So these bearings are new, they're different. I know, but I'm saying they're the same size. Yeah, yeah. So record this. Keep going. Yeah. So these are the bearings that I bought. They're nice, they're pretty cool. They have like green on the inside and they go pretty much just like this. They look dope as hell and they're supposed to give you more better performance. So more better performance. More better performance. <laughs> you see this? Oh my god. Oh my god. They are, I'm gonna die in these. So this is pretty much how these uh, how these wheels are made. This is the thing that attaches to the to the belt. You put this here, and they attach to the belt, and then that's how it does its rotating thing. Look at look at that! It's like so dope. You just whoop, pop it there, and you're good to go. There we go. Because when you were hitting it, remember? Either that or it can't fit. They have this. See this oh. thing? This shit is no joke. Like you, you get you get literally super shook. Holy alright, okay. Alright. Dude, you gotta you gotta you gotta try it. You go, you go. Right, 
So as you can see, it's definitely faster. It, it's, it's crazy. My, I got my boy right now. He's testing it out. He's trying to see if he, you know, if he wants to buy a set of those wheels. He's just, look at that. He is flying. So we're gonna set up a race between the um, old Dual Plus on regular wheels. It's supposed to do 22 miles per hour, technically 23. No problems with that. You see this one right here? We're gonna do a race. This track right here is gonna be the finish. That crack right there is gonna be the finish line. So I'm gonna go ahead and go up to my drone and we're gonna we're gonna race. We're gonna see which one's the fastest with the uh, with the new miles per hour now we're at 23, 24. Let's do it boy. So baby, crazy. So overall, um, pretty much I am I am happy as hell. Um, it's kind of dark, and I was supposed to record this before my ending uh, intro or outro, whatever. But right now, I just have to pretty much just state the facts. 100 millimeters, definitely faster. Makes it 100 times faster. It's insane. But the acceleration, the acceleration is a little. Ugh. The acceleration is a little slower, but the top speed is insane. When you are going about 20, over 20 miles per hour, your feet are already shaking. So I was a little shaken up. My first ride, once you see my first ride, when I almost crashed into like a couple of cars, I was literally shaking. And every time I go above 22, 23 on that specific board, I just start shaking. But overall, it's an investment, amazing investment. I, if you have a, a Mini X, I would say get it. Why not? Um, the only thing, what was it that you were saying before about the wheel about bite, the turning wheel bite? The front, you get a lot of wheel bite. The back, you might be able to get away with it. Front, you gotta have a riser. You're probably gonna be riding up. Take two. <laughs> All right. So the um, the front of the Mini X, S, whatever. If you put in 100 millimeter wheels, you're gonna want to put a riser on there. He's gonna test it out, see if it fits, because you, know, you need the you need the hardware to fit, right? But you're gonna get wheel bite if you really turn hard. On the back, you don't really have to worry about it. I'm all sweaty and shit. Oh, <laughs> um, <laughs> too, dude. Um, but tighten up the trucks because 24 miles an hour on the, such a short board, a lot of wobble. So yeah, this is be pretty much what it looks after. This is like not even a whole day of riding. This is three to four hours of riding just in one day. They obviously look disgusting because they're white, but overall, man, it was pretty That's good. The sides are.
Right guys, and that's that was our day. It's crazy man. It's, I'm about to take some some uh, some of the recordings my boy Latore did. Um, shouts out to Latore, I'm gonna link you his YouTube, his Instagram, all his shit down below. Go follow him. He also loves eboards, he loves all this drone shit. Um, and yeah, now I'm gonna take some of that footage. This is how you do it on the go. It's dark. I've been filming and editing since this morning. But that's about it, guys. I'll see you next time on Envy. Later.